Hello, I'm Bernard Hickey and welcome to interest.co.nz and the Economic Weather Report. Today we're looking at migration stats. And these are interesting because they have a big impact on the housing market and the general view on inflation. If we have a lot more people coming in and buying houses, that's going to pump up house prices and inflation generally. And the numbers for March are relatively good news for inflation, although if you're a home seller, it's probably not good for house prices. There was net immigration, so people going out, of 1,009 in March. And in the year to March, migration was only 4,678, and that's down from just over 12,000 for the year. So net migration in is falling. That's bad news for the housing market. Now the big driver here is migration out to Australia of New Zealanders leaving for higher paid jobs in Australia. Net migration to Australia in the year to March was 29,982. And in March itself, 3,753 New Zealanders departed in the month, in the 31 days. That was 121 New Zealanders leaving for Australia each day. That's actually up from an average of about 106 a day in the full year. So the number leaving for Australia is accelerating. Now this is a disaster, really, for New Zealand's skill situation and it's not good news for inflation because those New Zealanders leaving have skills and we're doing a job here and that is making the labour market just that much tighter. Now, let's have a look at the general picture there. It's clear there's a slowdown going on in the housing market and this news today will um, perhaps help accelerate that. And it's one more piece of good news for the Reserve Bank when they're thinking about interest rates. But it's probably not enough for the Reserve Bank to cut interest rates on Thursday when it makes its decision. It's interesting too to have a look at some of the detail on the immigration stats coming out this month. It's clear there's a couple of trends going on here. Asian migration is up, particularly from India and to a lesser extent from China. Uh, and Philippines migration, very interesting. Uh, now there are, we're getting twice as many immigrants from the Philippines as we are from China. European migration is down, however, and then the big move there is from Britain, where the numbers coming in from Britain are down by a third in the year to March from the previous year. That was the Economic Weather Report. I'm Bernard Hickey for interest.co.nz.